Hi, and it is the 27th Sunday of Ordinary Time. The Gospel today, Jesus uses the parable of the vineyard, of people that have gone to work in his vineyard, but the workers that run the vineyard don't like the boss that he sends. And so each time they throw that person out of the vineyard because they want to do it their way. They don't want to listen or even consider it doing it in a different way. We realize that what Jesus is telling the chief priests and the elders is when we are stubborn and set in our ways, our vision becomes very short-sighted. Jesus is saying that even when he himself comes to bring the word of God to them, they won't open their ears or their hearts or their minds to the message God has for them. Because they're too caught up in the violence or controlling other people. Think about it in your own lives. The times when we have had our eyes opened or we've experienced love from people that we didn't expect to get, how has that changed us? How has that made us people that all of a sudden see things that were right there all the time, but we just refuse to look at them? So Jesus is trying to say that the vineyard is the place that we have to attach ourselves to. We have to attach ourselves to things in this life that bring us new life. So the vine that Jesus gives us is a way that we can continue to grow in his love and in his spirit. And it's also a way that we can remain faithful to God doesn't mean we're going to be perfect, doesn't mean that we're still not going to be sinners, doesn't mean that we're not going to fall and make terrible mistakes. But what it does mean is that we continue to try and live the life that Christ wants for each one of us. I have to tell you, this past Friday we had an anointing service here in church and I was truly overwhelmed by the number of people that took the time to come out Friday night. And I know there were many of you that would have liked to come but had other commitments. But it showed me in a very powerful way how many people are praying for me. How many people love me and are asking God's blessings to come down upon me. I tell you that opened my eyes and helped me to receive it in a way that I never thought possible. So our challenge this week as we listen to the gospel is we need to let go of the things in our lives that are bringing us closer to death, the things that we're stubborn about, the things that aren't helping us, and we have to grab onto the things that are going to bring us new life. We have a number of things that are coming up in the parish I just wanted you to be aware of. We have our... Um, garage sale that is coming up and also our St. Francis Closet this Saturday. St. Francis Closet is bringing gently used clothes that we give directly to people who need them. And the garage sale is an opportunity for our singles group to raise some funds and for you to also clean out your garages a little bit. Um, we're also on the 24th of October the singles are having a, a Halloween party at Ozzy's in Hawthorne. So we'd invite you to put that date down to come. It's supposed to be a fun evening. Once again, know that I am praying for you. And I want to tell you how much I appreciate your prayers for me. God bless you and let's make Church in the Nativity a wonderful place to worship. God bless you.